the world, I will destroy you. I see it. Hey everyone, it is your favorite futuristic hedgehog of the past, present, and future, Super Hedgehog here. So, skipping past all the introductions, well, I'm happy to be here, and I've gotten a request to react to, um, uh, well, something called Metal Runners, and it was made by Super Mario Glitchy 4, or SMG4 for short, sure, but yeah. This request hit and I think I'm gonna like it, so shall we hop in? Video games are everything. Jobs, entertainment, lifestyle. It's the engine that powers society itself. And to make it in this society, you need to win a lot. Be it in FPS games, platformers, battle royales, you name it. There are gamers who train every waking moment of their life in hopes of becoming the best. And at the top of the food chain, you have meta runners. People who are willing to replace their limbs just for a boost in accuracy, dexterity, and performance. With legions of I'd be lying if I told you I wasn't a game freak, nor am I addicted to games 24-7. So yeah, the world I'm really I into games. Planned. Just a heads up there. Until the world sees you, Tari. <gasps> Hold on a minute. I think I've seen this scene somewhere before. Up in a game somewhere. Or a movie. As a matter of fact, imagine waking up in a world where it was just full of games. But wait, would the food be games? Would everything be games? Would... Would the people talking be turned into games? If it was just a world full of games this and games that, would it lead to certain problems? Will we ever get to see our families again? Would it change the future for all the people? Will, will enemy people become real? Will chicks, will chicks become enemy girls? Nah, that is a cool dream to have though. But anyways, let's continue on with the video, shall we? That really looks like a reference to something. I can't exactly say what, but it really does. Look like something. I'm so proud of you, Tari. Hello? Is anyone there? We're going to ramp up the difficulty a bit. I want you to try your best. How we all walk into our homes after a long, hard day. Oh no. Oh, no, 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 I swear if I can just put my finger on it, then maybe I can figure out exactly where this scary game came from, or which scary game this thing came from, because I'm seeing a lot of references in here so far, and I'm not sure if anybody else is noticing them, except me. Those effects make them look like they're, uh, they're from that one game 
with the paint guns that was on Nintendo? Fuck out, splooms, splashings. I, I don't know. I forgot. Anyways, I'm not. I'm. I don't even think I'm really supposed to know about all that anyway. But besides that, let's just keep going. Okay, here goes. Wait a second, is that? Hey, uh, that cybernetic arm. You're a meta runner, right? Excuse me, can I have your autograph? Um, oh! And this, kids, is why celebrities never go outside in public. Although, some may do due to enjoying all of the fame, I guess. So yeah. No, no, I, I'm not. Which gaming company are you with? COG? Cloud7? Uh, Alpha Max? Um, yes! Uh, you believe this? I'm with Tazcorp? Uh, that's right, and uh, speaking of which, I, I think they're calling me there now, so gotta go, you know. <laughs> smoothed. Really, really smoothed. Yaddy yaddy does it. What is this? Metal Gear Solid? Sheesh. Have all these metal arms and other things. If you could tell me where I am, my memory's a bit hazy. Ah, I see. Party too hard last night, huh? No problem. Everybody's here to help. You're in Silica City, the video game capital. Silica City? That sounds. Familiar. And there's no better place to be in Silica City than a Tescorp Superstore with top of the line peripherals, tools, and gaming enhancements, as well as the world's greatest esports team. Tescorp is the most trusted name in gaming. Tescorp, the new meta. Um. Now let's find a perfect gaming enhancement for you. Maybe a geosynchronized orthopedic mouse. You know, this should really actually be a thing for 2020 or even further than that. Yeah, this should really be something for the nearby future. Meta runners? I mean, like all that metal gear and stuff? It looks so high tech. It seems like I would be so much easier and everything would be easier if this was just used. So, yeah. It's all or nothing now. There's the setup, and now she's positioning herself. Oh, and there it is! A perfect wall clip! What is she? She's now glitched herself inside the wall, allowing for the final and hardest part of the glitch. Here it is! The coconut first jump! Will it be enough to break her out of the wall and fling her to the goal, though? <laughs> Holy smokes, it works! It actually worked! This is it! She just has to land and we have a new speedrunning champion! Oh no! She missed! She just... 
That is the most saddest. This is the most saddest thing that could ever happen. Like, it was right there and you miss it by an inch. That's just sad. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad I don't have to witness any of this. I'm really happy I'm not the one doing all this. I probably would have been mad too. Honestly. What do you think you're doing? This is the speedrunner's arena. I don't know if you understand, but you need this thing called skill to be. Oh, oh I made it over the spikes! Yes! Oh! <laughs> Hi. Uh, don't suppose you could show me how to make Coconut Boy go as fast as you did? <laughs> you want me to teach you advanced speedrunning tricks when it looks like you've never touched a game in your life? Fine. I'll just figure it out myself. This world revolves around games, kid. If you ain't any good, don't bother. Go be a janitor or something. Wow. All she wanted to do was game, and this is what happens. I mean, I wouldn't criticize someone no matter how good they are. You know, or anything like that. Ain't gonna get you anywhere. So you have played this before? Am I winning? Okay, now I'm confused. So, by playing that, did she, like, teleport into the what? world with a coconut person, I guess? Or, what's going on here? Who the... Take that, foul beast! Well, I guess that, uh, answers my question. Girl, you all right? Uh, Lux, you might want to see this. I'll call you back. It's one of my meta runners. What is it, Belle? I'm extremely busy explaining to the press about your disappointing failure of a performance tonight. Hey, screw you, man. You go and do better. Oh, wait, you can't play video games for crap. There's no need for language like that, dear Belle. Need I remind you who owns you, and who can decommission you in an instant? Really? Intimidation? Come on, Lux. That might work on your other meta runners, but we both know you wouldn't let anything happen to Numero Uno here. Maybe I will, after today's performance. <laughs> hmm. What triggered this? I don't know. She just sort of freaked out and froze. I thought I broke her, you know, emotionally. Wait, Coconut Boy? Lux, is she in the... Bring in the Tazcor scientists. I want all of them here, now. Well, uh, that was shocking. Talk about, talk about an SAO reference. <laughs> get into a game and then suddenly you get transported into it. But 
that's not just an SEO reference, that's also a no game no life reference. Yes, I have watched a couple of animes with that same reference, and I've watched other animes as well, so I sort of know a lot. I don't know about Sonic or Shadow, but I do know that I'm watching pretty much a lot of things, and I seem to know a lot more than the others, I suppose. Yeah. And that right there brings us to the end of this video, so make sure to keep it transistic, stay futuristic, and subscribe to me because it's no use, and I will see you in the next vid. Oh, and don't forget to hit that dimensional notification bell to always stay up to date to whether a new video comes out for me or not. But other than that, wait, why did I say or not? That won't make any sense. Anyways, yeah, see you in the next one. Silver, your futuristic hedgehog is out.